Yo, what's up everybody? Jumping here and I am back on some Elden Ring. And I need to finish Stormville Castle. I did about half of it, I want to say. So there's still actually a lot to do. But I am at the lift side chamber. And the first thing I want to go do is I need to break this statue. Which also means I'm going to have to go and get that one giant. Oh god. Hello. I need you to go away. That's a lot of damage. And hyper armor is awesome. Dogs are never fun though. Nice. Okay, so here is the statue. And I need to go the other way. Hey, I just got a weapon. Huh. I kind of remember that being a really bad one though. Let me know. No. Man, I hate these birds. I gotta do jump attack. I also have to lock on these birds. The dogs and the birds. I just feel like you almost have to. It's very hard to hit them. Unlocked. Let's try it here. Yeah, look at that. I look like a fool. Come here. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna die. This is just bad. You're starting off not great. There's a dude here too. Oh wow. That was a bigger guy. And he got one shot it. I actually need that stone. I think now I can actually upgrade my great sword to plus six. Which would be awesome. I still have to get that bird. Where is the bird? Wait a minute. Am I crazy? Did I kill the bird? I don't remember killing the second bird. Okay. Well, that's good, I guess. It's gone. Maybe the bird got depressed and decided to uh, take care of that. Be proud. You were a fine warrior. Your only mistake was your choice of master. Let the winds lift you to a higher place. Okay, we need to talk to her. I'm not going to summon her, though. I don't think it matters for her story, either. Well, who do we have here? Tarnished, are you? Clearly not one of Godric's lot. I am Nefeli Lu. Tarnished and warrior, like you. I'm here by decree of my father. How utterly repellent this is. This grafting of Godric's ill befits a lord. He's tainted the very winds. If you intend to challenge Godric, I ask you call upon me. The winds run foul with his deeds. I'm certain father would permit me aid the fight. To be honest, I think she makes the fight harder. Just because he does get more HP because it's co-op. And she's not the best NPC. Apologies, but I've idled long enough. As fellow tarnished, we must each follow our own guidance. Down whatever road takes us to the throne of Elden Lord. Alrighty. Well, I definitely also want to get this Grace over here. So, let's get this dude to chase me. Hey. How you doing? No. Oh. Uh-oh. I think that big dude has ranged attacks. So I gotta watch out. Ooh. Uh-oh. Oh. No. No, no, oh, he's, he's, the bird's back. Why is the bird back? I'm so confused. Come on, down here. Oh, no, look at that. That is overpowered. The tracking of that attack was insane. He just teleported to me. Oh, 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 oh. Ow. Darn. <sighs> you know it's a real bummer. I actually have to do everything again. It's all good. It's more XP, right? Alright. Buff it up. 
we have to take this guy out again. Ow, ow, ow. No. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I feel so bad at this game right now. It's ridiculous. There we go. Oh no, I'm so bad. You see, like, sometimes when, like, someone's not locking on and you're watching them play a Souls game, that's because they want to not lock on and they're going to attack and hit the enemies just because they can do that, like I'm trying to do. And then other times when you see people not locking on is because they don't know how and they're real newbies. I think I'm looking more like that category right now. <laughs> I'm not looking very, uh, good. There we go. Locking on makes that so much better. Alright, I'm gonna lock on this time. And try to just get a hit right away. Still missed. Alright, roll attack. Ooh, no, 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 come here. Yeah. Yeah. I actually felt the power of that attack. There we go. Let's go in here. And I almost did not get this item. What is this? Hey. Well, I don't need any more of those. I think I have to have the level 3 stones now. I really should maybe summon dogs. Oh no, no, no. I can't even do that, right? Because I have to come over here. Now let me definitely take these guys out. Oh no! Okay. Not yet. Just follow me on down. I gotta watch out for the range attack. He is a little stupid. Come on. Yep. Let go! Run! Ugh, oh, you're making me bored, dude. Here we go. Yay! You know what's funny? I don't even need the stones now! Oh, you big. And easy to hit. Little jump attack. Yeah! He is done for. Okay. Give me the item! I cannot pick this up. Alright, we got it. And we can also grab this. I will drop down there. Actually, no, I'm not going to drop down there. Dropping down there from here is a very bad idea. There may be an item that you can get going this way that you can't the other way. But going the other way over there, you can still drop down. So that's how I'll do it. I'll try to make this efficient, even though I don't remember how to do that. But I definitely want to get the grace so that is the plan right now and then from there we will just wing it i could just go and take out the boss i also want to activate the great rune and i'm probably gonna stumble upon that at some point so maybe it'd be better just to have it we will see there is a lot to do still in this castle even though i'm at the end so i think i will save the boss it's just Makes more sense to do everything else first. But I will go upgrade my weapon because I want it to be maxed out for this point in the game. Plus six is as high as it can get. Although they did just give me a level three stone, so technically maybe I could get it higher. Alrighty, well I'm going to cut this ahead. I'm going to see you guys in a moment. Alrighty, well... I upgraded my weapon to plus 6, and I might be able to get it to plus 7 if I find another level 3 stone, because I have 1 out of 2. Now I'm going to take this guy out just for the XP, why not? And it's just fun to fight him, 700 damage. That is wild. Okay, give me the critical. And one more jump attack, that should do it. Yup. Yeah, jump attacks are just crazy when you have these giant weapons. 
and the poise damage too. It's pretty wild. Now over here, this was actually the final secret that I discovered in this castle. I didn't use any guides, just me and my buddies were just doing co-op and exploring every inch storm color. I think that is actually the good one. It looks like it. I've seen it in like a million videos for PvP mainly, but I think it's really good in PvE as well. And it's like some type of spin to win move. I think that is it. If that is that move, I have to check it out. I'm going to have to try that at some point. I want to try that Lion's Claw really bad too. So I think I may start upgrading the Claymore just to play around with that weapon. It already has it on there, so why not just use the Claymore? And the Claymore is a great weapon. All right, so this is the final little secret. And even at the time that me and my friends discovered this, there was like no messages or anything to help you, you know, find this. Because nobody, oh my god, I suck. Nobody was really finding it. But I was so like mad. I'm like, I cannot figure out how to open that door by that bonfire. I mean, Grace. And that was the thing. It was like, it's the final secret. There's got to be a way to open the door. So it took a while, but finally we were able to figure this out. Okay, we have a knight and a bird. Yep, there's a bird. I don't like the bird, so I'm going after that. Yeah! Okay, I got the knight too. See, now that is good. That was very good. Let's go back over here. This way will give me that one great shield, which is a really good shield. But I don't want to use the shield. I'm not going to use one the entire playthrough. I do like using the shield for the noob's guide because really, you know, I think that if someone is new to the game, a shield is a great way to like help you figure out how to just play because the main thing is learning how to attack and when to attack and then as you're blocking you will start to roll a lot and just dodge attacks and then over time you're like i don't need to shield no more so i think that always using that for the noobs guide is a good idea but for you know normal playing i don't really ever use a shield okay Buff up. And let's get him. Oh, 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 that's a lot of guys. Yeah, that range of that sweep is insane. There's another guy down here. Hello. Bye bye. Alright. That was an army of dudes. One more. And now I have the shield. Go ahead and pick this up. Oh, hey. I am probably going to go back again at some point to upgrade this before I fight the boss. To me, that's the reason you want to actually, like, explore, right? Before you fight the boss. Because when I get to the boss, I'll be fully prepared. And by prepared, I mean extremely overpowered. Because, yeah, I think I am. That boss is going to get wrecked. But now that I'm bragging and saying that, I'm probably going to get destroyed. Maybe by his fire attack. Just because I will not remember how to dodge that. We will see. But there's no reason not to now go underneath and get that golden seed. But I have to fight that one mini boss. Which... That guy, I think, will probably get destroyed by this weapon combo here. I think so. I'm gonna try to plunge these guys. I wanna get the one all the way over there. I, I want it to be cool, though, you know? Let's try it! Okay, that was horrifically bad. What was I thinking? Ooh, there we go, got one. Now the bats, are they hard to hit? Unlocked? Probably. 
Ow. Ow. I don't see you no more. Where did you go? No. Alright, he's gonna walk into it now. Come on. There we go. Did I really just say he was gonna walk into it? I meant that he was gonna fly into it, which is what he did. Okay. Gotta go down this way. Pick that up. They are just giving me all the stones right now. Oh no! Thought I wasn't gonna make that. This and it's a rat party over here. So let's get him. Wow, that sweep! Oh, that guy didn't die. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. You okay? I'm just back up for a second, you know. I feel like I'm playing Hell Divers. This is all I do now in Hell Divers. It's just run away. Okay, ow. Ow! <sighs> Rats and their fast attacks. There we go. It took a second, I just had to get that hit to land. And it was over. Give me that. And there's a scarab. Oh. Okay. That was a bad swing. I have never used that spell ever and I don't think I ever would and I've gotten it every playthrough I've ever done I've always come down here all right we need to pop this uh, I might be in trouble here I don't know if I'm gonna be able to buff my sword now oh no it worked good let me hug the wall there we go little jump attack only got like one blade to hit that wasn't good he's moving around like a maniac got a decent hit yeah that's a good hit actually Ow! I can see that tail flying a mile away come here okay good hit good hit oh he's exploding oh uh, okay I forgot about that I needed to run away ow no 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 leave me alone for a second for some reason, you can do like these short jumps sometimes, especially against this guy. And when you can do that, like he gets completely wrecked. Okay, that was a lot of damage. Well, he's cooked and that's another golden seed for me. Thank you. I don't know how many I need to level up my thing again, but I have seven currently. Well, technically I have eight. Because of my other potion. Let me come on over here. Now, wait a minute. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I'm supposed to come up here and find this blood stain. There should be one here, right? Or is it down here? No, nah, it's down here. Alright, yeah, that's the one. And I can ask that guy about that later. Alright, I'm going to climb up this ladder. And where does this take me? I do not know, but this is a very big ladder. I remember this. Like, damn, how far was I down? I know that, you know, you're dropping down or whatever. But look at that. That's insane. Look how far down that actually is. It did not feel like as I was dropping down, it was this far down. Look at this. I guess because I'm actually getting like back up to the castle, maybe it's so high. I don't know. That's a wild. It's a wild ladder. We drop on down. Where am I now? Uh, hold up. Oh. All right. Yeah, I know where I'm at. I guess technically I could just teleport out of here. I should have never even climbed the ladder. That was a big waste of time. Uh, yeah. I'm running. Goodbye. Uh-oh. I couldn't really see. I wasn't sure if it was there. That could have been really bad. 
All right, now at this point, I kind of know like one spot I can go, which I could open up the one sword stone door. That's where all those enemies are. And that actually, I do think, takes me behind where all the crossbow guys are. So if I do that, I can actually get to the front gate. So I might do it because I need to activate the great room. Is there any other place I need to go right now? I don't think so. So I'm going to go kill the boss. But I'm going to cut this ahead and we'll see you guys in a moment. Alrighty, well, it's time to murder the boss. But I did go back to the round table just to upgrade my weapon to plus seven. I almost forgot about that. Now, to be honest, I could go all out here, right? In a way, how do I do this? I know I can, oh, there we go. So let's do this. We're gonna chug this. We're gonna war cry. Now we're going to swap weapons to this. We're gonna buff. We're gonna chug, and we're gonna go on in. Mighty dragon, thou art a true born heir. Lend me thy strength, O kindred. Deliver me unto greater heights. Well... A lowly tarnished. Playing as a lord. I command thee, Neil! I am the lord of all that is golden. Yeah, he's pretty golden, that's for sure. Okay, summon the doggos. And let's go hit him hard. I forgot about golden bow. I could put that on too. I have that, I just have to put on a dagger. Alright, I want jump attacks. Leave my dogs alone! I forgot about that attack already. Let's chug. There we go. Come here. Uh oh. No. Ah! Oh yeah, that's hitting hard. One more. Yep, I knew it. Let's do this. Oh. Uh oh. Now I'm just gonna chill. Uh oh. I remember you have to run! Run, 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 run! There we go, lock on. Get a little jump. 858 is kind of crazy. Uh oh. I need to do this. There we go. Now I'm gonna chug. There we go. Now I'm gonna jump! Uh oh. Get that arm out of here. Oh, you're so done. I am the Lord. Of all that is golden, and one day we'll return together to our home, bathed in rays of gold. I don't know how to put this on. There it is. Let's do it. Jump for joy! 
That's been a long time. But I just got my rune. I'm super happy about that. Also, that weapon of his, is it good? Again, many weapons. Uh-oh. Can I talk to the girl? Wait, what? Oh. That looked weird for a second. Oh. What a pathetic excuse for a lord you were. <laughs> Craven to the bone. Pushing me about like that. And after all that grafting, where did that get you? Look down on me, would ya? Godric, you filthy slug. Feel it. Feel it. Feel my bloody wrath. Oh. Hello there. This weasel was... Godric was always looking down on me. He got what he bloody deserved thanks to you. I tell you though, what goes around comes around. He had an ugly heart, an uglier countenance, and met the ugliest of ends, eh? <laughs> Hey, that's right. I remember they added this in. Oh, okay. Well, I want to buy that. I would have bought that when I would go back to him with the gate, but I guess he's not going to be there no more. Alrighty. Well, it's good that they let you buy that stuff because you used to be able to miss it and not be able to buy any of it. And that was definitely not cool. Now, I do have to go this way. I want to, like, talk to the one girl. And I want to get to the other side to get the sacred tear. And that also, like, triggers other things, I guess. I did go back and talk to the one lady. I got that one quest item. And I got a golden seed from her. And then she, like, went to the round table. The thing with her, though, is I have to get past this castle, and then she can actually upgrade my ashes. Okay, so those are eyeballs. And now that I have those, I think the girl will appear at this grace, right? I believe that is the trigger. And I can feed her these eyeballs, because this game is designed by a very strange individual. <laughs> So I don't know why I can do this, but I'm doing it! Hello? Is someone there? My name is Hayata, and I'm journeying in search of the distant light. If I might be so bold as to ask, would you donate any Shabriri grapes in your possession to me? My eyesight has been weak since birth, you see. I can't tell which way I'm supposed to go next, but when I eat one of those grapes, I can feel a distant light in the back of my eyes. It will lead me to my true duty as a finger maiden. Oh, many thanks to you. Now I can feel the distant light once more. You are most kind indeed. May the blessing of the fingers be upon you. Yeah. <laughs> it's just strange. I can't remember exactly, like, the eyeballs. I think it's like the eyeballs of finger maidens or something right so they eat like their own eyeballs i don't know it's very weird stuff you are most kind indeed may the blessing of the fingers be upon you i guess she's gonna move now you are most kind may the blessing of yeah she's gonna move okay let me light this and i believe like that is the trigger just walking here will make like the one girl allow me to upgrade my stuff now which I think I can at least a little bit but I really want to grab this and now I'm going to teleport back to the lift side chamber and I'm going to circle around to the front of the gate and basically activate this great room that's going to be the final thing don't think I'm missing anything else. I'm trying to remember. Was there any other little area I didn't go to? 
think I've been to most of them. Besides, there was one spot I kind of skipped, but it's all good. All right, I'm going to cut this ahead. I'm going to see you guys in a moment. All righty. Well, I need to go this way. And then from here, I'm going to take this guy out. I want the XP. Oh, no, I didn't buff my weapon. That's not good. Hold up. Just chill. Let me do my thing. There we go. Now I can take this guy out. And the dog, too. Come here, dog. Yes, he walked into it. That's what I wanted. Okay. Let me jump. Don't kick me. I'm gonna jump. That works, man. That works great. Alright. I really don't need to fight none of these guys. I've already taken care of it. But just for the XP, I will trigger some. Why not? Come here. Don't like how they keep dropping stuff. Oh no! That's a lot of dudes. The run attack should actually take out a bunch. Ooh, ow. Come here. Ow, ow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Chug a lug lug. Well, I wanted them to bunch up, but they just refuse. And now my weapon sucks buff again. I do believe there are rats down here, right? Oh, yeah. Alright, nice, nice. Good little sweep. And we did it again. Made that a lot easier. Pick that up, and we can use this. I believe I have an extra one of those because I went to Moore's Castle first. So that was kind of worth it. But what this does is that this allows me to come up behind all the crossbow guys. So in my opinion, there's really no reason to ever go that way where you can just do this. You open it up. Now, to be honest, too, this is... Wait a second. If I go up here... This might be that little spot where I'm missing a couple things. I think I can actually go get them still. And then I can actually say I 100% at this. Although I'm sure I might have missed one little tiny item somewhere. But there are some Storm Knights up here. Which it might be worth the XP. Why not? Yep, here we go. See? I could have missed that. Don't want to miss that. Took him out. Come here! Ooh, I feel so strong right now. It's actually crazy. I think there's a cookbook over here. So I will go and get that. I just noticed something too. Oh! Get out of here. I gotta keep going up for the cookbook. I noticed that one guy on the crossbow as I was climbing up the ladder. I'm going to check that out again. Take this dude out. Thank you. No, oh, no, no, no. How did I not get the hyper armor there? That felt like pretty late. Oh, I see why. Because I probably ran out of juice. Oh, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone for one more second. I can't remember how to play. There we go. I couldn't remember how to actually... Oh no! <laughs> this is lame! I can't remember how to activate my stuff so I can actually do damage. There we go. Hey, I got a somber too, so it was totally worth it. Give me that. Alright. Is there anything else? No, I've been over there before. I want to check this out because I can see like this guy on a crossbow. And I'm thinking he's in a different spot than all the other ones. Is it here? Where was it? I seen that. Oh yes, yeah, these guys. You know what? I could totally go this way. 
I never ever thought to try to jump this. This is really smart potentially. Cause these guys are the worst. Let's do it! Oh, that was it. Okay, yeah, see what I'm talking about? They are the worst. That was potentially really bad, but he's going down. Oh no! Bunch of flowers up here that I don't think these things ever respawn, so. Worth it. Where's the other one at? Oh, he's over here. Okay. Ooh, yeah. I might have to try, like, using a crossbow. Crossbows, I'm sure at this point they've been buffed. I remember they were bad, but that was a long time ago now. So I'm hoping it's good. I have never taken these guys out yet, so you know the rule. I don't even need to actually worry about this weapon not working, at least against these guys. Oh yeah, oh no! It's like the great sword is strong enough that it don't matter if I don't have the stats for the one. Give me the item. Oh, there's one more. Let me grab that too. Don't shoot me, please. Thank you. Let me double check, too. Anything up here new? Cool. Now, I'm going to be closer to the lion, but I never took out those one crossbow guys. But the good news is that I don't actually have to go that way, unless I want to break my rule. Because everybody has to die. At least once. So I might have made this a little harder on myself now. Speaking of making sure everybody's gone at least once this guy is up here chilling maybe an item up there too all right don't hit me with nothing please ah get up my name it may be jumping but i cannot jump for nothing there we go anything else up here uh uh yep we got an herb that's what i'm talking about now let's go on down it's kind of funny whenever i don't have all my buffs and i'm gonna chug this now when i don't have my buffs it's like my health bar is pathetic got one it, it, hyper armor where is it come here uh oh all right good grab that let's chug one potion and a dream we still have to fight that one guy, although I could run to the grave. If all else fails, I will do that, potentially. Because that's the smart thing to do. Okay. And let's do it. Wow, somehow it let me do that. Uh-oh. Uh oh, he moves like a maniac, so I probably should lock on, but I don't want to. Good jump, good jump. There we go. That was a great jump there. No, no, no. Oh, you missed me, because I'm unlocked. See? When you're unlocked, he can't hit me for nothing. I can't him, hit him for nothing. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, I take it back. He can hit me. Chug! That was the one potion. Now I have the dream. Ooh, six, six, six! That's not a good sign! I'm gonna die now. Yes! That was actually clean. Okay. Well, I can't say that I didn't almost die. I mean, look at my health. That's kind of wild. Alright. I'm going to rest here. And I will level up, too. Before I lose it all like a dummy. Also, I can do this. Thank you. I think I'm going to break my rule about those crossbow guys. I hate to say it, but once I get to the top of this tower, I definitely do not want to go back. And right now, I also do not want to go back. Alright, 20 is fine, so I'm going to keep putting some points into strength. And I'm going to hope at some point, with this weapon, I will meet the requirements. So I don't have to suffer and not have the requirements. Give me that. Is there anything on this bridge? Oh yeah, 
There's giant guys with bows. It's not the coolest thing ever. Oh, they have to get up though? Okay. Oh, that guy doesn't have a bow. Uh oh. That means the other one does. No, 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 no. Ow! Oh, how did I get hit by that? I'm so bad. Alright. No, they. Why do I think they have bows? Like, they don't have bows. That's good. Alright, well. These guys are really weak to damage if you actually hit their weak spot. Alright. Is there a bow? Oh, there is a bow. I knew it. I remembered. I'm not dumb. Ow! Okay, this is kind of bad. Ow! Well, I, you know what? The bow guy's my friend. Hold up. Oh, thank you, bow guy. Oh, get that fire out of here, though. Burn him! Yes, burn him. This is amazing, actually. That they can damage each other. Look at the damage! What was that? Wait, wait, wait. I gotta do the buff. Come here. Yeah. Yeah, that damage is ridiculous. Okay, you know what? I'm going to just two-hand this for a moment. Because this weapon is great. Although, wait a minute. Let me do this. I'm going to buff. And I'm going to two-hand this one. Because that one is way, way better in terms of damage. Alright, let's get this dude. Come here. Don't you shoot. Don't you, don't you shoot. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of amazing. Oh, that's right. He's the archer. And because he has a bow in his hand, even though he looks identical to the other ones that have, like, some type of weird axe weapon, he has a lot less health, and he's way weaker because he dare picked up a bow. Yeah, it's just my way of saying it. I never understand that. Why is that a thing? If they have a ranged weapon like a bow, they always die so much faster. Oh, wait, what? I thought I can get the horse up here. Well, I am not going over there. I know there's an item or something, but that's going to take forever. And I still have to take this elevator all the way to the top. It'd be cool if, like, the Colossus weapons, at least like these swords, could act as a back shield. I mean, why not, right? If something was to hit me in the back, I don't think it would do that much damage to me right now. This giant thing would protect me. Kind of looks like a cape, too. Yeah, right? Well, now that I have these weapons upgraded and everything, I think I may actually try to use something else next episode. So, I'll figure it out. I'm not exactly sure, but... I'm really leaning towards this claymore because why not I want to play around with, with this lion's claw and I can probably upgrade this thing to at least plus six maybe I'm not too sure we will see but this attack is so cool and now we can go and activate this ring I think this is my favorite one I just like the stats. I'm a stat four, I guess you could say. There we go. So I have it. I must equip it, I guess. Yes. Let's go down here. And we also need to see something. Let me put this back on. I want to see, like, with this little setup, how high can these stats actually get? Hold oh, one sec. So I have to pick it, right? Boom. And I have to activate it. Where's the item for that? Do I not have any? I don't know how to activate this thing. I think it's an item that I can buy, though. It's like rune arcs, right? All right, well, give me a second. Actually, no. I don't even need to cut it ahead or anything. 
We're just gonna go on over here and buy it. Why not? I'm pretty sure the merchant here actually sells it. Problem is here though, I have to still teleport out because I need, there it is. You know what, I'm gonna buy them all. I probably should have been bought those. I just didn't remember. Now, do I just use it? Yep, there it is. All right. But I still have to go back because I can't do anything here. Oh, yes, I can. Wait a second. While we're here, I'm not going to talk to that guy right now. But while we're here, I'm going to drop down here and do this. And we can still kind of see, like, how high we can get some of these stats. All right, boom. And let's take a look. That's insane. I have 56 strength? What? That is insane. What you bowing at, bro? Get that out of here. Ow! Okay. What is he doing? There we go. Mm -mm. What did I get here? Oh! I do think I get something decent, right? There's a weapon over here. Well, let's put it this way. This weapon was okay when I played it a year ago. I don't know if it's like really good now or just all right still. What is this? Oh yeah. So what does this do? I think it's like a pure faith weapon, right? Oh yeah. So it only does holy damage. Which means that against anything that's weak against holy, it should be really good. And anything that's like really resistance against holy, well, it's probably pretty bad. Alright, well, I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I really hope you have enjoyed it. Make sure to like the video for me and be sure to subscribe for future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I really do hope that everyone has a very nice day and peace out.